He faced a judge today accused of shooting and killing a man in Norwich back in May. And police also still looking for another man accused in that crime. News 8's Tina Detail on the scene in Norwich to break down what happened in court today. You can still see a bullet hole in the window here at TNA Fashions. Now it was in front of this Norwich store right here on the middle of the street that Johnny Amy was gunned down back on May 20th. Today, four months later, one of his accused killers is in court. 34-year-old William Long ordered held on $1 million bond, charged with murder and attempted murder in the shooting death of 25-year-old Johnny Amy. It's still feel hurting. It's still hurting, but a lot of relief to see one of these guys is going to be brought to justice. Gilbert Alexandri is a family friend. Neither he nor Johnny's father know William Long or 25-year-old Daquan Holmes, who was also accused in Johnny's death. But they are glad someone has now been arrested. Oh, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling so happy yeah, when I'm seeing him. News of the arrest reached his wife, who was in Haiti. She's still crying day and night. Billy Dickerson was at the bar where the fatal fight first broke out. I mean, I just saw the kids. They were young kids and they were arguing and it was about a girl. He doesn't recognize Johnny Amy and like some, wonders if he was the intended target. Johnny's family just wants the second alleged killer caught. There's nothing they can do to bring him back, but if they can catch him and just justice is done, so we'll be relieved. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That would be something. These bullet holes are another reminder of that May 20th shooting. Now, Norwich police are hoping if anyone has information about the shooting or the whereabouts of Daquan Holmes, that they will give police a call. On the scene in Norwich, Tina Detell, News 8.